Easter Market, located in Detroit, Michigan, is a weekend farmer's market that has been around for the last 125 years, with up to 40,000 visitors coming in every Saturday from all over the metro Detroit area, and over the years has become quite the tourist attraction. But since the COVID-19 outbreak began in early March, the market has gone back to its original form, a farmer's market for local Detroiters. Carlos Parisi has been a food vendor at Easter Market for the last 11 years, where he sells his locally made Aunt Me's Detroit chips, salsa, and guacamole, and has experienced the shift firsthand. Actually, no, Easter Market never shut down. It's really, like, that's one thing that a lot of people think is like, oh, wow, it's crazy that Easter Market's opened back up. No, Easter Market did not close once during this. Every weekend, there were still vendors here. While it wasn't all of the vendors, a lot of the vendors had stepped away. There were still a handful of vendors and you could walk through. Now granted, it went from being in the thousands of people here to being literally maybe 200 people walking through on a Saturday. So it really slowed down to the point that nobody's ever seen before. So it was really interesting that we saw kind of like what was originally the market, which is basically just locals coming in, buying whatever they needed, then getting out. Over time, it became very touristy. But then this year, because of the pandemic, you can see that there's a lot more focus in it being a shopper's market again. Everybody here has been for, uh, to come in, to pick up their goods, the things that they absolutely need. They come in, they go home. And it's been, it's been really nice in that perspective uh, because there's just a bit more focus behind what is the, the definition of the farmer's market as opposed to a tourist destination. Since the reopening of businesses in Michigan began on June 8th, most vendors are back at the market and new precautions have been put in place as the market prepares for crowds of people again. So people are coming into the market, everybody's you know, wearing masks, constantly washing their hands or using hand sanitizer. It's just kind of indicative of what is becoming the new normal across not just the city but also the, the country, the world.